IV insertion. Before beginning this procedure, always perform the following steps to ensure patient safety. Perform hand hygiene. Provide patient privacy. Introduce yourself. Use two patient identifiers. Verify allergy status. Perform environmental safety check. Ensure proper body mechanics. Gather all supplies. Provide patient education. Verify MD order. Assess for procedure need. And explain procedure to patient. Educate patient about the rationale of procedure and associated adverse reactions. Materials needed for IV insertion. IV catheter insertion kit. Alcohol pads. Gloves. Extension tubing. Peripheral IV needle. 10 milliliter normal saline flush. The procedure. Place tourniquet on the patient's arm. Inspect the patient's hand and arm. Palpate and select vein. Vein should be soft and bouncy with light palpation. Select another vein if the vein feels hard. Release tourniquet. Prepare supplies. Open IV insertion kit. Prime IV extension tubing. Cleanse insertion site. Allow it to dry. Reapply tourniquet. Anchor the vein. Insert IV catheter. Assess for blood flashback. Lower and advanced catheter with placement confirmed. Advance the catheter until hub rests against insertion site. Remove needle. Activate safety device. Stabilize catheter and remove tourniquet. Connect the extension tubing to the catheter hub. Confirm patency by drawing back on the normal saline syringe and checking for blood return. Flush the line with normal saline slowly. Note any swelling or patient complaints of pain at the IV insertion site. Secure IV catheter. Apply transparent dressing over insertion site up to where the hub and tubing connect. Loop tubing next to IV site. Tape to patient's arm. Label as per facility policy.